I am gentleman. This is my cow. Welcome to the Gentleman's Pixel Club. Please enjoy the video. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. I am the gentleman and welcome to the gentleman's pick scrub. I assure each of you that no cows were harmed in the making of that video. That cow was actually being saved. If you don't milk them, they get bigger and bigger and explode and it's boom, you are instantly covered in cow milk and udder flesh. And that is not a good experience. So we helped a cow, we stopped a cow from having that devastating experience. But what are we doing for you today? We are playing a game called Mike Mech from LC Games. This is a game that's recreated on the Mr. FPJ run in the Commodore 64 core. I have got no idea how this game plays and it is a disc based image that we've loaded into the Mr. FPG, FPJ, FPG, Mr. FPJ. So hopefully, hopefully we're in for a good game. And this is the game already loaded. So we've got a couple of options here. We've got ship layout, best scores and credits. Well, let's see what scores we need to be. Okay, 3,000, we should be able to do that because we are awesome. We are absolutely awesome. Um, ship layout A, ship layout B, and oh, A and B. Now, the only thing I know about this game is it's called Mike Meg. It's from LC Games. You can see the logo I created above me for them because I think it's very important to advertise companies and do as much promotion as you can on these videos. They produce produce like this for us to be able to play. Is it produce? No, I've got cows on my brain. In fact, is milk even produce? It doesn't really matter. But they produce products like this. Products, not produce, products like this for us to play and if you can give them a little splash a little fun put that logo up that kind of thing it's absolutely worth it so i'm hitting play to start the game here we go so that tells us the cargo spaceship taurus 400 is transporting precious milk from asteroids and something's going wrong here so alien entities have entered on board along the way we actually played aliens free if you follow these videos in order yesterday and we're playing another game where aliens get involved dear god aliens have got a hard on to destroy humanity at the moment so mike the mechanic mike and the mechanics that was a band i think he's got to go through the uh, go through all power rooms on the ship and reactivate batteries avoiding the deadliest touch of the aliens all right i probably should have been paying a little bit more attention so room zero one get ready and there we are Oh, he looks like Mario in space. Oh, look at this, look at this. It's, it's one of those games where you, you basically uh, colour the platforms in, he says, making it up as I go along. Oh, you can headbutt them and it does it as well. Why can't I? Oh, I no, that's a big jump. Come on. Oh, no, I didn't even get that battery. All right, yeah, so we colour these in as we go. Okay, this is interesting. Let's get the battery. 100 points look at that we're going to be on the high score jump that blob oh different colored batteries as well is that more points i really don't know okay oh i see we've got a timer at the bottom as well got to focus on that well this isn't very hard so far you just know it's going to amp up and get hard very very quickly and there is room clear the first room is completed and look at this we have blazed our way onto the high score table i don't oh, oh okay yep right now things get a little bit more interesting i don't know about any of you that are watching this video um i but i do know that we've had quite a few new subscribers recently hello and a warm welcome to each and every one of you and thank you for subscribing to this little channel you really don't know how much it means to me it means a hell of a lot Okay, so this is quite interesting. You're having to jump and float down with those. So that's probably going to come into play a lot more because I've got to get those bloody ones above the bad guys there. Not challenging yet, but you could just feel, you know, this is on the edge of going to shit very quickly. Oh, fuck it, and I died. How can I die on room two? Now, does it reset? No, it doesn't. Kudos, absolutely kudos for not resetting this. This is good. I bet you this is 
going to change. I bet you as you go through this game, e.g. I'm on a yellow platform here and I jump up and that's still yellow. I bet you you can toggle that on and off as you go... Oh, fuck's sake, I needed to jump it. I bet you you can toggle that on and off as you go through the game a bit further on in the game, e.g. the platforms have multiple colours or you go over them twice and it turns it off, so you've got to do it in a set order. As I say, not played it before, no idea on what to expect. I'm just speculating... Okay, now I've got to jump things. I don't like jumping things in this because I've died already. Oh, here we are. Another battery. Are we going to ignore that? No, we got that. Oh, that was a nice lot of points for that one, wasn't there? Here we go. And this room will be complete very, very quickly. And holy hell, look at the size of that score. You know, that's not a big score that I've got, but look how big that can get. They haven't got those extra zeros at the beginning for no reason whatsoever here we are oh interesting enemies look floating enemies all right so it's not confined now to the platforms oh is that ch it's fucking chasing us oh shit all right okay let's get the battery let's get them all right chasing enemies has now made it a little bit harder for miss you ha well i'm a little bit smarter but 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 this are oh, the did that light again? I don't know. No, of course it didn't light again, but it beeps again. All right, jump up there. Fall there. Whoa. Okay, that was tight. I didn't think I was going to clear that room with that enemy that chased me. But, yeah, in the UK, it's suddenly got a little bit colder. I'm having to wear this hoodie. You know, we're, we're, we're in the winter era now. The era where everything is... Oh, for fuck's sake. Everything is too bloody cold. And now I've got to put the heating on, which is going to wreck my life. So if this channel suddenly goes off the air, you know I could not pay my heating bills. All right, so here we are. First, uh, 3,670. I actually thought we did a little bit better there on the points, but maybe not. So let's do G, P. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, am I going the wrong way in the alphabet? I don't know. Alamen, O, P. There's P and C. Here we go. Come on. Dear God, I am going the wrong way. What a fool. Same mistake twice. Absolutely typical. GPC, so saving scores. So this is the disk image of a game, so it's going to save it to there. And if we look at the best scores, we are number one. All right, so let's go again. And let's flip it to ship layout B for this time. And, you know, we're then going to do A and B. And then probably have a little bit more play through here. Because, you know, I want to get to the harder levels. So fire to get through that intro. We don't care about what went wrong. Shit. Okay. Maybe we should have stayed with what we can do and what we know. Holy mother of evil bricks. Look, look, look at that. That alien, the bloody, it stays above me now. It's a pursuing alien on, on that platform. So I've clearly got to do those ones from the top. There. How'd you like that? I got some of you before you could get close to me. How on earth? I'm looking at that alien at the bottom there. Thinking, how the hell am I going to do that? Okay, grab that. Yes, that's how to do it. Haha, -ha, skills. I have skills. That was a minor miracle that I did that, actually. I did not think I was going to make that at all. Oh, don't you... Oh, you look... You look at this. It goes up as well. Are oh, you utter... Mother ho... What on earth? Ah, I wonder, I wonder. Is it a quick run? Is it a quick run to try and beat it? Time. Time. Yeah, oh, no. Shit. It's, it's got to be a race. It has got to be a race because I can move faster than it. Oh no, and I land in that. Come back. Oh, sh holy fuck. That, that was, right, we're doing that one again. That, that was hard. Alright, so I, okay, let's put, 
In fact, we're just going to hit the space. I'm not going to put anything on the scores unless I get a big score because I was so stupid at navigating that. Here we are, play again. That was awful, that level. That, that can't possibly be that hard. Fuck me. If this, if, if this is how this set of levels is going to progress, this is going to be a nightmare from hell. Honestly, honestly, that, that was really, really stressful. Okay, I think we're just going to do this bit as the last bit here, clearly, because this is where we are. But, you know, it, it makes sense to just run and do that, but bloody hell. So I like the graphics, sound is minimal, but it's suitable for what you've got so far. But you know what, this, this is the first level on the first set, good god. Alright, room two, I, 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 I hate to even think. Okay. Oh no, no, I'm being, uh, no, 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 okay, how do I get from, oh I don't. Well, that, 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 that ended very quickly. Okay, what's that? Oh, teleports. All right. So, yeah, down and you, you move. All right. So, oh, God. This is right. I can tell you now. I can absolutely tell you now. This game is, is going to cause so much fucking stress. You know, you feel yourself burning up already. You know, you, you, you feel the, 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 the little bits of stress slow, slowly coming in as you're pursued by these enemies from hell that are just absolutely relentless you know how how on earth do i even do i even get ah oh shit do i even get up there pitiful score eleven thousand and sixty that can just have spaces saving scores saving failures i should say well that 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 that, that was just hard all right let's try a and b and see what we have play Yep, yep, yep. What's it going to do now? Okay, all right, so we're here. Fine, we can do this level. We know how to do this level. We are a champion at this level. The concept is really, really simple on this. The, the, the difficulty on how it amped up on that level was just insane. There, there's something I'm clearly missing here. It's the first time that I've seen it, but you know, it was absolutely insane. And some of you may be wondering, well, where can we play this game for ourselves? If you have a look right now, there's a little ticker that's scrolling along the bottom of the screen, and that tells you the URL where you can go and get this from LC Games. So room clear, and let's go on to the next one. So let's also uh, point out that I am not paid to do any of this. You know, I do this for the love. I truly do this for the love. The love of playing retro games. The love of playing new retro games. You know, new old stuff, which is, you know, what we're doing What we're doing here. You know, new games on old platforms recreated on new hardware on the Mr. FPGA. Yeah, I could, I could actually legitimately fire all this up on a Commodore 64. But you know what? This is a damn sight easier to do this, and I will be doing it this way. And I forgot to get all of these. Damn it. I thought, oh, that's going well compared to the first time. And look at this. I didn't get any of them. So now I have to go and get all these at the top. Stupid, stupid. So, yeah, I could play this on, on a Commodore. I actually have all the stuff to do this, but you know what? The Mr. FPJ recreates such a great version of the Commodore 64 and all the other platforms as well. It is just easier to do it this way, but you will have the same experience on... The, oh, oh, okay, you will have the same experience on the real system. So here we are, this level was cleared bloody quick, bloody awesomely from me, if I say so myself, with no failure and no loss of lives. I hope you saw the URL on the bottom of the screen. We'll leave that ticker there just for a little bit longer if you haven't, if this game appeals to you. Okay, ah, here's the one. Here's Mr. Pursuey. I'm going to chase you round the screen, but you know what? I'm not going to be as a pain as everything else that chased you uh, on the, the, the first level of the, the other session you played when you played the different layout. So the layout doesn't seem to have changed too much, and all I can assume 
and it is an assumption here I just don't know is that we get this map oh fuck it I died we get this map done and then you eventually have all the other rooms that you didn't do from the other level no idea how it plays out no idea what order they're in doesn't really matter as off oh, mother hens as long as we're having fun and th th this is uh, this is me, me on my channel the, the the lives get blown so quickly when you go into a point of yeah i know what i'm doing and, and you get a little bit cocky and you wreck it you know why i just can easily have done that when i had all those lives i bloody don't know so we should be number one on the high score if i can do well on room four Yes, got you, got you. Did we pass this before? I can't remember. Yes, we must have passed it. Look, there, there's nothing here to even be hard. Okay, I'm wondering what other obstacles, what other challenges we will get on this game as we go through as well. You know, I do want to see a little bit further into the game. So, you know, this, this game, it, it looks simple to play, you know, but isn't going to end you know suddenly and just say yep we'll stop now i do want to do a bit of exploring but you know we will we, we'll, we'll, we'll probably try and get to at least 10 levels so room clear and we'll have an awesome score when we do this what is next room five okay well at least we're not oh no i ruined it damn it i'll say at least we're not being pursued and i just wrecked that jump all right, so we will put the GPC up here because, you know, we deserve to be... Oh, I've gone the wrong bloody way again. You know, I, I need to get a big post-it and stick it on the screen and say, High score, push down. Come on, come on, come on. I wish that you could you could hold it and it would just automatically do it. Because I don't want to be putting high scores in. I want to be playing. So, score saving again. Okay, ship layout, we're going to go back to A, I think, and just stick with that. But we're going to have a look at the credits. So here we are, concept programming, graphics and sound uh, by Luca, room layout by Ste Stef Stefano, testing Stefano and Luca, and email. Well, these are the people that made the game at that email address. You can read that for yourself if you choose. Right, so fire to go back. And we're going to play again. Skip that. Skip that straight into room one. So, yeah. Let's give us a goal of trying to get to ten sheets on this game. That's the goal. Ten sheets. I think we can do that. I pray that we can do that. You know, I want to explore. I want to see a bit more. I want to see some of the things that, you know, we've not seen yet. I want to see what new obstacles they put in the way. You know, but the, this, so far, this is really, really good fun. And I recommend this game, the gentleman recommends this game. Jump up there, jump up there, and watch some skills as I fly over him, and we complete the level in a decent time. So, 40 there. How many points does this give us? We had 320. Okay, so 400 points. So, it times it effectively by 10 on every bonus that we have. Okay, we are not gonna forget to do the the these under side blocks here at the moment. The movement on here, the controls here are really responsive. You know, I make mistakes in games. You know, I have made a few mistakes in games. As I've played games but playing this particular game here you know every mistake has been mine to own it's not due to the controller or anything else like this you know this just flows and works well I'll oh, look at him bash his head on the ceiling as we go and here we are so we should get 320 points on top of what we've got there boom I can do maths yes god I hope that was right all right uh, mr. pursuing all right this is where it went horribly wrong and I remember from my mistakes before, we had that block in the middle, which caused me all the pain. There we go, get past all of you, fall to the bottom. 
Nice, nice. So, knowing that I could get the hard one out of the way first, it was worth doing it. So, I think room four next? Yes, room four next. So, this room and a few more to do to achieve the goal of ten rooms. I'm waiting for spikes. It needs spikes. It has to have spikes. You know, every platform game has spikes. So, we've got to have spikes soon. Jump up here. He so looks like a Mario character. He really does remind me of a Mario character. And that, that's not a bad thing, by the way. You know, they haven't ripped off anything in any shape or form. It just reminds me. And, you know, we can talk freely about what things remind us of what. Here we go. That was done. Good. Room clear. No, we right. Okay, so this is the furthest we have been. All right. So we need to focus now. We need to focus. One problem, one challenge at a time. I'm just looking at that blob thing there. He sort of moves in a four-way pattern. How is he moving? Oh no! Fuck it. I thought he was going to move uh, and we were going to just slide past it, but no, clearly not. Thank God. And generally, thank God that this game doesn't reset everything because otherwise it would be hard attack city. It really, really would. Alright, so let's jump and do that. You know. Oh, that's got to be a leap of faith, an Indiana Jones leap of faith, and we screw it up. Okay, have I got that wrong? Did I not jump right? Can I not jump that far? Yes, we can do it. All right. Oh, there's going to be a lot of wild jumping to fall back down to get these things on the sides that we've got to do. Okay, it's going to be part of this nightmare. Oh, yes. Okay jump nice got you all right i don't think we can do that jump here no because that's going to be in the way we have to cross i believe we have to cross at the bottom oh i'm looking at the time as well 28 seconds time stops for nobody not even me not even the gentleman all right so how are we going to do this we now up here we're going to jump we're going to get that we're going to get that Puzzle time, but it's got, yeah, it's got to be on that platform. Oh, nervous. Oh, I've just done it. 12 seconds. God, that was tight. I probably did it a really ass about face way, but that was tight. Room six, four more to go. Oh, look at this. Okay, now, now, now things jump around. Bollocks. I jump up and get there. No, I can't come on. I need superhero jump, but I don't have that. Run, yes. No, we forgot that one here. We have really, really got to focus on things that we that you know are gonna be hard to get because we're gonna have no time. We're gonna run out, we know we are. Alright, now all I can do is go up here. Go up here. I need to probably jump on. Yes. Boom. Alright. And let's jump on this platform. Nice. This is certainly a thinking puzzle. <laughs> I jumped because that battery appeared. And uh, I did not expect that. Just to appear there. This is certainly a thinking puzzle game. Okay, we're going to have to time this to go there. Right, okay, we've got one shot at this 12 seconds. 
Oh, nine seconds. Look, it goes red as well. This, 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 this is getting hard. Room seven. Oh, this looks easy. Oh, come on. After everything we've just been through, how can we not blaze this straight away? This has got to be a simple routine with everything we've got. You know, the biggest challenge looks to be those green guys. Oh, and the blue guy's coming after me as well. All right, maybe, 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 maybe there's a bit more challenge here than what it looks like. Okay, lost a life, lost a life. Room seven, get ready. So let's go up here, let's go here. All right, so we've got 55 seconds to get our way. In fact, how the hell do we go to the top? 40 ship is ticking by. Oh no, I think I know what you've got to do. Oh, that was a little bit too <laughs> precise. Oh! That jump there, I thought I was wondering could you make it? Is it doable? It clearly was doable, but it was like, oh. You know, tight buttocks time. Okay. So we can make those little jumps at the top. All right, I didn't know that. So 27 seconds, no lives left. seconds whoa that I didn't know I could land safely there I thought that was gonna be game over room eight come on two more after this can we do it oh there's a teleporter there as well so we push down for that boom there we go full there full with style I need to be really aware of, need to really be spatially aware of what's going on here. Thirty-eight seconds. All right, come on, I'm down here. Come and get me both of you. going wrong it's fuck it it's going wrong and look at my time and we got one shot of this one shot holy hell oh we've done it wrong we have done it wrong come on. last shot we actually have one more go <sighs> four seconds okay this is brilliant this is so hard but it's brilliant room nine I thought that was going to be such a walk in the park. 56, 55, come on. We, did, we, did, we deserve, for all our brilliance, we deserve another life, having wasted some of our lives elsewhere. I wanted to collect the battery to see whether the battery gave you more time. So I wasn't watching. All right, 43 seconds. We know we're on 43 seconds. Come on, what are we doing? 39, 39. I've got to get to the next level. Okay, 
let's do these first because I'm really not comfortable about this area where we are now. Now this has got to be one from here. Nice. Oh, level 10. We've done level 10. Room clear. So we've got to where we want to get to. So, you know, this will be the last playthrough of this. But brilliant, brilliant, brilliant game. Uh, we've got the bloody pursuing things as well. Okay, teleport. Teleport. 53 seconds. No, right. Okay, so it doesn't give you more time. I just wanted to fall and do that. Because you know what? We are, this is effectively, oh, can't, aha, what, why, oh, damn it, why, oh, I can avoid you, yes, no, bollocks, there was another one there, um, yeah, this was the last uh, throw of the dice of that, but this has been fun, and we will be putting our name in the high score here, G, P, and we press down, we were going the right way as well, here we go, G, P, L, M, N, O, P, and C, so it saved the scores, but you know what, I think we need one more go, to have a look at the ship layout B and we want to play that because I want to see whether we've learned anything from what we've played here oh hang on did we do the I'm sure I did B is this the start level oh, I'll get myself confused now all right doesn't matter we'll do this playthrough but I just want to because there was a really hard level and I'm sure oh well doesn't matter you know, I, I was expecting in my mind. I, I've probably lost track of what's going on. I was yes, this was it. This was it because of that thing that followed you there. Um, and oh, I just want to get to the next level, have a look and see what was there. You know, this isn't about getting to level ten or anything else like this. We're just playing um, ship level B, which I'm sure was harder than ship level A. But in my mind, I thought we had a teleport right at the beginning. Who knows? Who knows? Let's have a quick look. So go here, go here, go here, go here. Oh no. Alright, that didn't work out. Room one, get ready. Right, so what was on the next level? What was next? Yes, this was it. This was the level I wanted to have a quick look at with everything we've learned. Yeah, the, the, the way they pursue you, it's just, it's just not right. You know, it's, it's hell on earth. Okay, I get what you need to do. You need to sort of teleport and fall at the same time. So let's teleport here. God almighty. It wants you to do a lot. But how do you get up to those ones? Honestly, how do you get them? All right, we're not going to find out on this playthrough. Actually, let's just put space a few times. We're not going to find out on this playthrough, but this game has been absolutely stunning. I've really enjoyed playing Mike Meg. Hope you've enjoyed this playthrough. I hope I haven't spoiled too much of the game for you. Clearly, I haven't got very far. I'm not so sure how big this game is. It's probably huge to have multiple ship layouts that you've got. And when you combine it by doing, effectively, ship layout A and B, you're into a long, long game. But LC Games, thumbs up from me. This really, really is good. I'm the gentleman. This is the Gentleman Skips Pixel Club. And again, I promise you, no cows, zero cows, were hurt in the making of this video. I will see you soon. Goodbye. Please like, share, and please like, share, and subscribe to this channel.